I would also like to suggest that you do not share your affirmations with others who may poo-poo these ideas. When you are just getting started, it is best to keep your thinking to yourself until you have achieved your desired results. Then friends will say, oh, your life is changing so much. You're so different. What have you been doing? Jamie, ding dong the xylophone. Jamie, make a ding dong sound. Ding dong the xylophone. So now, again, Jamie didn't produce anything for this week's show. It's very, very upsetting, and he's been very depressed. I have 25 affirmations here for Jamie. Okay. And uh, let's, see, let's see, Sam, if we can get some soothing music under here. And, Jamie, I want you to read these affirmations. <laughs> okay. Perhaps something classical. I've collected these. I've collected these from various sources online, and they're supposedly supposed to keep you from killing yourself or yeah. something. Or, and you then, know, in turn, prevent us from killing ourselves. From killing ourselves. For real? Exactly. Exactly. So, Jamie, now hold on. I want you, when you read these, I want you to take them very seriously. I want you to focus on them. And after each affirmation, we're going to ask you a little bit about what that affirmation yeah. means and to Jared you. And okay? Jared is here as well. He will be commenting. Jared will be coming. I mean, it'd be nice if the mic was actually pointing at Jared yeah. and he wasn't just looking so smug there, yeah. you know. Always, look <laughs> uh, <laughs> always looking smug. Yeah, smug. pretty much. So, Jamie, let's, let's get into 25 affirmations to make, uh, make Jamie feel better. All right, yeah. all right. Here's the first one. I am beautiful. Okay. Oh. Now, how does that make you feel? Not so beautiful. Right. Let's just, that was uh, a failure. I don't know if that one's... Let's go ahead and move on. We're firm. No, no, no. All right, all right. I'm, sp- uh, I'm really special. Okay. <laughs> I'll buy that. All right. How does that make you feel? Jared? Of course everyone's special. Yeah. Oh. Duh. Or, yeah. Or really That's how- not going to make them feel better, Jared. I'm looking around at present company, and I'm, I'm tempted to believe you. How yeah. special am I? Yeah. You, you're pretty special. Yeah. All right. Next affirmation. Special Ed. Take this seriously, Jamie. <laughs> Take this Jamie. seriously. All right. I am smart. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Do you think you're smart? Are you believing these affirmations as we go along here? Let's take an IQ test. All right. We're going to do that. That's nice. Right. You've, just, you've right. actually just contributed something to this yeah. show. That could be a segment. Okay. Continue. All right. I can do anything I want. Is that true? Ooh, that sounds kind of disastrous. Yeah, that actually s- sounds I, like that murder us or something. Yeah. <laughs> That's not good. Ooh, let's hope that doesn't really no. its ugly head up. I want to fly. I don't see that happening. No, you're oh. right. All right, All right let's, let's, let's scratch that one yeah. off the list. I don't know about that one. Jared, right. what do you think? Of course. A- anyone can have, be, or do anything they want. Be that or do. absolutely true. But can he fly, J-Rod? Well, Without dying. We can't... <laughs> When he lands. We can't yet defy the law of gravity. That's that's the problem. Yeah. So time we need time. Perhaps one day we could get a time machine. That is a problem. Mm. Yeah. I hate this plan. Well, like twenty years into the future, maybe. All right, Jamie, move, continue with your Will next you affirmation. I'm I'm a <laughs> wow. <laughs> I'm about to say winner, but it's winner. Okay. okay. You are a winner. You're is, part, it, is that the affirmation? Yeah, yeah right? I'm okay. a winner. You're part of a wonderful radio show, and you are in fact a winner, Jamie. I hope you remember that every morning when you wake up. Yeah. Continue. What did I win? A prize. A prize. <laughs> you win a wiener. Go ahead. Yay. <laughs> Continue. People only have control over me as long as I let them. Okay, we're gonna mm. we're gonna actually just scratch that one. Yeah. Off the list, okay? <clears throat> because yeah. we ha- we actually have complete control over you. <laughs> so that was actually an error. I'm gonna <laughs> scratch that one off the list. Oops. Okay, go ahead, Jamie. Oh yeah. I can love. Okay. Oh, that's okay. a good one. I yeah, think I thought valuable. we knew that, Dana. If that's what yeah. got you in this book. That didn't really affirm anything. We didn't already no, affirm. Exactly. All right. Yeah, Moving right, right along. Dana will never have sex with me, but that's okay. That's that an is important okay. one. That's yeah. an important one to remember. Yeah. <laughs> because that's never going to happen, Jamie. Ouch. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. As long as you know that. I don't think that's gonna make him feel better. <laughs> no. <laughs> these, these, are, these are meant to make him feel better, though. Yeah. So let's continue. Keep going. I can never let go of my fears. What? What? <laughs> I I don't know. I'm scared of everything. Yeah. All right. Oh, it's fears. Fears. Yeah, fear. I thought fear. you can never bears. let go of the fears. Yeah. yeah. Oh. All right. Grasp it at those fears. Right. Moving right along, Jamie. Your next affirmation, Jamie. You're sure I'm not scared? I'm uh, scared to read the next one. Well, That's my fear. This could have backfired. Okay. So continue. Uh, oh, yeah. Let's face our fears. All right. All right. Wait. I can let go. <laughs> Come on. You, you can let go. You can let. You okay. Can okay. Let have go. the strength, Jamie, to let go. Jared, help him. I will stop beating up myself. Oh, yeah. yeah we'll do, we'll <laughs> is, this, do, is this literally? Yeah, or? We'll do that for you. I've noticed a few bruises lately. Mm, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Go. 
we don't talk about that one. Yeah. Brian? I'm what sorry. I, tell you? <laughs> I try not to leave marks. It's yeah. hard. <laughs> Jamie, Great. continue. Your, your next, Jamie's next affirmation. That thing I... That thing I did with a carrot was when I was nine doesn't necessarily mean I'm gay. That's true. Oh, <laughs> That is carrot? a good point. And I want all the boys and girls to remember out there. Well, I guess yeah. just the boys. Yeah. That thing they did with the carrot does not necessarily mean you're gay. Is that right, J-Rod? Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank right. you, Jim. Please, Jamie, your next affirmation. Do you eat the carrot? <laughs> well, that, that's what I thought it might have made me gay. But I know it's not necessarily true. Oh. Mm. Continue. Jared? Oh. It's because it's, a, it's an orange veggie. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. You know, carrot does make you see things a lot clearer. Does yeah. it? Yeah. All so right. eat the carrots, guys. Carrots make things seem bigger, mm. too, I find. Yeah. Yeah, metaphorically yeah. and physically. Yeah, good. Yeah. All right, Jamie, your next affirmation. I will never. I will be my own hero. Good. Yeah, that's <laughs> a good one. <laughs> so, so I'm a superhero now. Yeah. All right, compose yourself. I swear to God, Jared, if you start talking about superheroes, I will kill you right <laughs> Here now. Comes. Everyone's got a hero in them. <laughs> good. Good. Yeah. Wait, wait. Am I my own hero? Are you? Well, you just said it. Read the affirmation yeah. again. Read it. These I are not sinking in. Apparently. I will be my own hero. So say it with confidence. Yeah, and I will be. And you better damn well do it. Jamie. I will be my own hero. Good. I think that worked. That did work. Okay. Mm-hmm. Continuing on. Your next affirmation. Dude, spramp it up a notch. Yeah, spramp it. Spramp it up uh, a notch. Oh. <laughs> I will listen to my inner voice. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Oh, that sounds. That doesn't sound so sounds good. Right. Mm-hmm. Jamie, your next affirmation. Are we gonna live past this, Brian? Well, keep going. No, no, no. no. I will ignore my inner voice. When it's gonna bring me, when it tells me to bring a gun to school and shoot Brian and Derek. Oh no. Oh, oh. I will shoot Michael instead. Good. That's a good affirmation. That's. <laughs> <laughs> hold on. That's going right to the top of the list. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah, your Continue. next affirmation. I love my body. All right, let's just get right <laughs> past that one. I don't can want I, any elaboration on I that. I think I hate myself. Let's, I'm crossing that one right off. Jerry, I think you've seen more of it than anyone else has, so can you comment on that? That's a good point. Okay. Your body's like a vessel, so... Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. You, got, you only get one, so better love it. Yeah. Yeah. Don't listen to, don't listen to J- J-Rod, Jamie. Oh, God. Continue, All right. Continue with your next <laughs> affirmation, Jamie. I love the three bodies that's... Got- I love the three body currently in my trunk. Oh, <laughs> that's a good one. Oh no. Ooh. That's a good one. <laughs> right. I think that's gonna get stinky. You know, just make sure you put a lot of kitty litter in that trunk, okay? Please, for oh, me. Yikes. Okay, continue on, Jimmy. Your next affirmation. Mm-hmm. I'm a divine being. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh yeah? What does that mean? It means that you're divine. It means that you're godlike. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Say it with confidence. I think that means you're gay, Jamie. Is what it means. I'm a divine being. <laughs> but that's all right. Exactly. <laughs> Let's move you that one to the, the top inside. of the list. Yeah. Yeah. It's all those oh. carrots. It's all those carrots, Jamie. <laughs> Keep going. Jamie, your next affirmation. I will follow the true Christian God plans for happiness. What? All right, that's a pretty good one. I did what? <laughs> I don't know. Read that affirmation again, Jamie. <laughs> it's not. Say, I will on. follow the. One true Christian God's plan for my happiness. All right. Okay. Jared, how do you feel about that? Okay. I'm not so sure about the true Christian God thing because okay. on Tuesday on campus, I, f- I saw these banners, they're like yeah, yellowish right. banners with, dark, with black text. You know, the one that says yeah. Judgment Day or, or uh, Redeem Yourself or redeem, redeem Your Sins. But, okay. But uh, you know what? God, you know, if there was, if there is a true, true God, He will never judge you. He will always love you for who you are, for whatever you do, no matter how many mistakes you make. Good. Yeah. Okay. There you go. There you have it, folks. It's okay. Good. And uh, who, yeah. who's who's you been to the Rose Parade? Um, I, I have. I've been there before. Yeah. You know, you, th- you know the one thing that made, made me want to go go Glenn close on roses. No. Oh. But okay. at, at the end of the parade, after everyone's done. There were there was this uh, couple of guys with some banners, and, and one of them said, "Trust in Jesus or go to hell." Like, what in the name of Zeus? Yeah, what in the name of Zeus? <laughs> what in the name of Zeus? That's good, Jaron. All right, we've we've hit a sore spot here. Yeah, we have. I don't even remember what this segment's about anymore. Affirmations. <laughs> I don't know what the Keep hell's going. going on. All right, all right. Felix, Brampton right, in the face. Let's, let's get back. in the face. Let's get back in the mood here. Let's get back. That's let's too get back in the mood here. If this is stupid radio show is God's plan for me, 
I'm gonna kill myself. Smuggle a p smuggle a bomb into heaven and blow the whole crap shack to little pieces. What? Right. Well, that's promising. What? That's promising. Where did you get these from, Brian? This is from a very reputable site oh, yeah. of affirmations. I don't know about that one. It is. I swear. Jamie, your next affirmation. <laughs> oh, yeah, you gotta say, insert name here, insert that name here, yeah, and exactly. insert that name. Take this seriously, Jamie. Read your next your next positive affirmation. Err. Uh, oh, yeah. It could be worse. I could be a Muslim, Catholic, Jew, Buddhist, Hindu, <laughs> Scientologist, or Jehovah's Witness. That's a good point. That is a very what? good point. It could always be worse. Jared, how do you feel about that? <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Hinduism, maybe. Maybe. Muslim, absolutely not. Oh, Jared. That's a dead no-no. Jared, that's the worst thing I've ever heard you say. Why is it a no-no? Hello, have you, have you seen the terrorists lately? The Muslim terrorists? The I feel like this is getting into uh, no, some no, dangerous no. material over here. Yeah, I mean, for some reason, they they, they, they think God... God. No, 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 it's going to be a Jehovah's Witness, so I can knock on your door. Yeah, I yeah. think that's far more annoying, actually. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> knock on your door. You're going to ding-dong the bell. Yeah. Yeah, not All knock right. on doors, ding-dong. All right, Jamie, your next affirmation. Positive affirmation, I might add. Go on. I have a huge long... That oh, is wow. a positive affirmation. <laughs> that is a positive that affirmation. Is. Jamie's right. got a smile on his yeah. face right now. Oh, uh, no. Jamie, read your next affirmation. It's okay to lie about having a huge <laughs> long. That's an important <laughs> one. Also. Equally, equally as uh, important yeah. to yeah. remember. Long. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. So next. Your next going? affirmation. Well, actually, hold on, Jared. What do you think about that? Yeah, actually, yeah. <laughs> Why are we? Yeah. We should, let's touch that one, yeah. shall we? Um. Come on, Jared. <laughs> Schlong that thing. What? <laughs> you know, s smart money's on uh, on the affirmation that you're you're a winner. Because everyone here in this room, not just in this room, right. but everywhere in the world, mm -hmm. is a winner. And and the hardest thing to do is to have a winning attitude. Yeah, that's very true. So we're gonna get you that winning attitude. I don't know Jamie. What's going on? So what happened if I lose? Oh, you just keep a winning attitude. I guess. You find something that you won at previously, yeah. and then you just hold on to that. Yeah. And you never let it go for the rest of your life. Be your own friggin' hero. Yeah. Don't you remember? <laughs> what number was that? What happened if I suck at everything? Wasn't that number five? Five, five, five? Well, uh, you're really good at sucking at everything. Yeah. Well, yeah, you're a winner. Well. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what number? What, what was the last number you just read, Jamie? 22. 22. All right, continue. Okay, We've so got a couple yeah. more here. All right, all right. I believe in me. Good. Good. Wait. Okay. Should I believe in you? Yeah, maybe. No. Probably not. No, I don't, I don't think you should believe in me. All right, your next affirmation. I'm just going to lie to you. Well, better spramp on it. Yeah. <laughs> Three spramps. I'm today. about ready to throw a pen at J-Rod. Continue. I believe in unicorns. That's a good yeah. one. That's yeah. very unicorns touching. Unicorns are unicorns. I think that's probably the best of all the positive affirmations. Now, just, just to lay it down for the audience, is there a difference between a unicorn and a unicorn? Yeah. Or a unicorn. Or a unicorn. Ha ha corn. All right. Okay. Your <laughs> next affirmation. <laughs> what are you and I corn? There you go, Jared. Ooh, all right, all right. Yeah. At least I'm not Patrick Gonzala. What? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. That's right, you're Patrick Swayze. <laughs> oh, no, 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 I don't want to be that too. Yeah. For all you techs, gaming, and entertainment needs, listen to Automosity every Monday at 5 p.m. <laughs> only on LancerRadio.org. Where did you get these affirmations from? This is a very reputable site. It's, re it's really specific. This is ripped right off the Tony Robbins website. Okay. Oh. I'm telling you. So, Jamie, do you, do you feel like any of this has sank in? No, apparently no. not. <laughs> well, Jared, let's hear it. you got to cheer him up. We're, we're at the last leg of this. Okay. So we don't really know what to do. We're going to kill ourselves. Out of all the affirmations I've heard so far from him, I, you know, I wasn't going to mention this, but... You know, I like I that in, idea better, but go on. In New Zealand, <laughs> uh, I, I, you know, did, did I forget to mention my ex fiance? No. No. What was his name? Okay. It was a her. <laughs> yeah, Brian. <laughs> and her name <laughs> was Phoebe. 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 If I swear to God, if you start talking about Charmed, I told you I will smack you today. Uh, Spam. This has got nothing to do with Charm because, right. you know, you know, when I met her, I was like in the most beautiful city in New Zealand which mm -hmm. uh, is considered the Venice of New Zealand. Okay. What, what city is that? I'm sorry. 
Uh, well, it's, uh, it's a little town called Fungare. Okay, Fungare. Fungare 8, good. Well, yeah, you know, they do use a lot of H's and F sounds there. Right. But, uh, right. A lot, I of, her, a lot I of. I met her there. We a lot of that. <laughs> we instantly fell in love, and she is half French, okay. half Irish, and she blended those two <laughs> accents together. And that's one thing I loved about it. <laughs> and you know what? Something I, I don't know. <laughs> we were in a we were in a s- fancy hotel, and I ended up proposing to her in French. Yeah, tell the story. Tell the story of how this happened. And, and I'd asked you, Jared, if love, love had ever touched your heart. Tell us the story. Yeah. All right. Okay, she was, like, depressed about something. So I, I, I told her, hey, look, why don't you come meet me at this re- at the restaurant, and, and we'll figure it out together. So we, so we booked a table. Mm-hmm. And on that day, and actually it was Valentine's Day, okay. I believe, Cupid's most precious day. Yes, yeah. Cup- yeah. Cupid's mm. most precious day. <laughs> oh, and we sat at a table and yes. we had a, it's a good place to sit. Wine or two, and I actually hit. You hit her? No, I actually oh. hit. <laughs> <laughs> Nicely done. Oh my Josh! Look, oh my Josh! I, I hit. Spam. Her, her engagement ring. Yes. In an oyster. Okay. Oh, there you go. So That's when, she, when she yes, it is. when she started when she consumed the oyster, she felt the ring. She took it out, and that's when I proposed to her in French. I, no, I don't know exactly what I said, right. but, um, <laughs> but uh, I, 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 I kind of rehearsed it yeah. for just just that one sentence in French. Right. Now, what would you have done if she had consumed the ring? Well, I'm gonna have to get Poseidon over. You know the Heimlich maneuver? Yeah. yeah. Or follow her around with like an empty soup can for three days. <laughs> <laughs> maybe. Maybe. <laughs> but there's nothing um, wrong with that. Oh the laws gosh. are the laws are different in New we, Zealand, so there's nothing yeah. wrong with that. Okay, we got we were engaged for a while, and uh, we actually have a daughter together. What? Wow. How old? Wait a minute. How old is this daughter? Blowing our minds. Yeah. Uh, she was born sometime back in 2004. Okay. <laughs> sometime. Um. In, does she have a birthday? <laughs> uh, no, 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 Phoebe wanted to keep it a secret. All right. Well, we're gonna. Uh, this is. Uh, don't wait to spring that stuff on us till the last minute, because yeah. I really want to like pursue this. Yeah, and and uh, we decided to name her Lana. Is there yeah. a, po- a possibility that we can get this daughter up in this studio? Uh, well, no, she's actually living with her mother. All right, that's probably for the best. Okay. That's all right. And um, yeah, but when we broke when we broke it off, she, you know, you know, to make me feel a little bit better, this is what she said. And Jamie, this is for you too. She said. All right, guys, we've we've had a wonderful show. We're gonna let J Rod J Rod continue to tell his wonderful story here. Thank you for joining us on this week's uh, episode of the Grotto. We love you. And gosh darn it, you're successful, and you can make it through this too. It's the thing that'll pull you through. It's your ultimate power.